A 1.2 million US dollar vessel equipped with a modern navigational system was earlier this week donated to the Grenada Coast Guard by the United States of America through the US Southern Command, SOUTHCOM, measuring 12 meters in length. The vessel was recently used to rescue a Venezuelan and an Italian national whose Piper aircraft crashed approximately 14 miles off the coast of Grenada. Prime Minister and Minister for National Security, Honorable Deacon Mitchell, said he expects nothing but rapid response of efforts given the exquisite features of the vessel. He presented the keys to the Acting Commission of Police, Don McKenzie, who then handed them over to Coast Guard Commander, Acting Superintendent Watson Edwards. This enhanced communication capabilities allow us seamless coordination with our military vessels and aircraft, empowering us to respond swiftly and efficiently to maritime emergencies. And as alluded to both by the Commissioner and Mr. Bostic, we had such a maritime emergency recently, which thankfully uh, ended well for everyone. And I too want to take the opportunity again to commend uh, our Coast Guard for the remarkable <laughs> job that they did uh, in rescuing the two persons who had the plane crash. Prime Minister Mitchell assured that the boat would be used for its intended purpose. This donation strengthens the unbreakable bonds of cooperation and friendship between the people and government of the United States and the people and government of Grenada. And it reinforces our shared commitment to maritime safety and security. And as Minister with National Responsibility, National Security, sorry, I certainly offer Mr. Bostic my assurance that we will utilize this remarkable vessel to its fullest potential. U.S. Ambassador to Barbados, the Eastern Caribbean and OECS, Her Excellency Linda Tagli Alatella, commended the Coast Guard for its exemplary service. As we walk around the pier here, it shows very clearly how much effort and dedication you put into maintaining your vessels and equipment. I am pleased that we can be steadfast security partners with you through the United States' Foreign Military Finance Program and, of course, through the Caribbean Basin Security Initiatives TAF team. Our long-lasting partnership continues to offer opportunities to grow and learn from each other to make the region safer. The United States Embassy and Southern Command are committed to continually supporting Grenada as our partner. We are comfortable to know that you are always vigilant and on patrol, keeping the waters of the southeastern Caribbean safe. Mr. Kevin Bostick, Director of Exercises and Collation Affairs Directorate in Southcom, says their donation shows the great relationship between the two countries. This is another leg in that stool that continues to show our partnership, our building the team, and our getting after the threats that are in the region. Sometimes the threats have a narcotics type uh, venue along with it but sometimes it's like they said the other day something a natural disaster or an accident and now the the boat you see over here on the side to you was able to get put to use before it even really got commissioned into the country we are happy to be here we're happy to be able to donate it if anybody doesn't know this is a 1.2 million dollar investment in the country yeah. Again, key for the United States to strengthen that partnership with Grenada, maintain that relationship with Grenada, and the only thing that we ask is that you use it for its intended purpose, sir, and that is your call, but it is a definitely a donation. 